But I'm going to just say that I have experience with this whole, whether you're an atheist Hindu or if you're an ex-Hindu atheist, this is the same discussion that people atheists are having in Israel, right? Mm -hmm. Am I an ex-Jew atheist or am I a Jewish atheist, okay? And the reason why that confusion exists is because Hinduism and Judaism are ethno-religions, okay? So because they're ethno-religions, Judaism, just like Hinduism, could have multiple meanings. It could refer to an ideology, a religion, or it could refer to an ethnicity, or it could refer to a culture. And true, more true. recently... With, so, yeah, but here's the thing. There's three meanings and a fourth meaning being added, both in Israel and both and in India. At the same, it's so interesting that how parallel this is. So for thousands of years, for many years, the word Jew and Hindu has three meanings. It could be referring to a culture, it could be referring to an ethnicity, or it could be referring to a religion. And people use it differently. And again, people, the fact that it could have three different meanings, people take advantage of that. Because sometimes they pretend that they mean this, but they actually are they're meaning their other ones. And they use it, kind of, they're very, they're very strategic in what they actually saying and what they actually mean, okay? And now both Israel and India is adding a fourth definition. You know what that fourth definition is? Nationality. True, so true, both true. India and Israel are now trying to make being a Jew or being a Hindu to have a nationality definition. So if true. you are, if you if you be, if you consider yourself a citizen of this country, you're a Jew or you're a Hindu. Okay, so true. they're trying to make like okay, you're an Arab, you're a Muslim, but you need to be Jewish. You need to have some Jewish. If you want to be Israeli, this is the right wing right-wing philosophy in israel right now then you have to consider yourself somewhat jewish you have to accept our culture you have to accept the jewish identity for you to be considered an israeli um, israeli citizen so they're sure. adding this for and this is the ethno nationalists are trying to add this definition same thing in india they're saying this is a country so israel is trying to be a country not just a, you know, it's not just a country of mostly jews but a jewish country Right, that's true. That's and true. India also is trying to be not just a country of mostly Hindus, but a Hindu country, and that is dangerous. That that is how you get second-class citizens. That's true. Actually, I mean, you're you're absolutely right about that.